bunch more information that if you like the page on Facebook, I'll keep you abreast of it. There's a lot of info that you may not get everything about. All right, so this book, this presentation is called The Hard Cost of Producing a Graphic Novel. My name is Russell Nolte. Those are the books that show on my chump. I've actually done some stuff. I've produced my own work, produced work for other people. Um, and let us... Generally, this is the rule, 20 to 24 pages. Um, and arcs run about four to six issues. Again, you have higher issues when you talk about Marvel and DC. Some other books have more issues, but generally an arc's gonna run four to six issues. Why are these two things important? Oh, and pages generally have five to six panels. That's the average, but they never have more than seven. The reason for this is because artists take pride in layout being one of the things they do for a book. The way that, that, the, that the panels look on a page means something to the artist, and they like mixing it up to show different things and different emotions. If you have more than seven panels, especially if you have seven panels more than once or twice in an issue, it starts to look very garbled together, and the artist really has no, the artist really has no, um, no way to make the panels look pretty. They can't make one big panel and a couple of small panels. They can't do any of the things that artists like to do on pages. All right. So why is this important when you're talking about writing? Because every page costs you money. Every page you do costs money. I'm going under the assumption right now that, that either you're going to be spending money to hire an artist or you're going to be collaborating and it's going to cost you time to do extra pages, your artists to do extra time to do extra pages, which will again cost you money. So, uh, arcs running four to six issues, the reason why that's important is when you put together a pitch packet, you're going to, there are, the people are going to want to see what your first arc is. You need to have one full arc. Now your book may be a serial, it may be a continuous book, that happens over the course of 10 years. But they're going to want to see arcs because that's how they split books up into trades. So if you look at something like Why the Last Man, I think does this really well, or Umbrella Academy, their books are not just one, they're multiple series. But especially Why, it's a continuous arc forever. Preacher, again, for a long time, but each four to six uh, issue, four to six issues became a trade in and of itself. 